okay guys so today I'm making a video to explain you how to create backups in Eternos and then how to make plugins how to play with snapshots so okay that was weird I mean snapshot so let's see so first of all we need to go to the backups folder okay let me log out from my main account I don't want to show my main account stuff okay let's just put something okay so rather just do this Finally, just let me in. I just create a server, create done. <coughs> That's the quickest way you can create a server without even looking at anything. Okay, then we go for backups. See, when you don't have backup, it just shows that with a orange signal that you don't have backup. So, and when going on this option you click this connect button then you just sign in with your google account let's just not sign in with my main let's just connect it to the second one okay so this will link with my google drive so this is how i get to link my backups so when we create a backup i mean we want to create a forced backup then we need to just type a name like okay like a backup and then create backup but it will it won't create a backup now but i mean i don't know why it just created because i don't have any world now anyways and you can also have automatic backups for your servers so that you don't have to worry and suppose your service just crashes or just some problem with your world you can load with the previous version previous time and just you can just do that so you make sure to turn on automatic backups for that so that you don't forget to create backups and just this happens okay so the next will be how to change softwares and stuff so So let's see so this is simple vanilla minecraft servers so if you want a server of for plugins you can select with paper and bucket and then just go and then select the version of minecraft it's that easy for if you want to have mods you can just change it to a forge server if you want to well snapshot is one of my viewers recommendations to play on they wanted that to see how to create snapshots so just so the snapshot available will be shown here you will be selecting it then just click install snapshot created done that's how we can play with snapshots in Eternos then comes if you want spygot or bucket server then this if you want fabric for mods then this mod packs for this glowstone server well magma works for only 1.12.2 so remember that and it and a magma server is the only server which can have as well as plug plugins as well as mods 
and there's also server versions for bedrock edition so if any of my viewers play in bedrock edition you can just have this windows 10 or just mcpe you can just create this servers if you want then plug in plug in one then just pocket mine that's how you do it so that's that's it in the console we can check for console logs in the files we can access the world files of everything our, of our, my server in the access you can create you can share your share access to some of your friends if they have an as Eternos account they will be able to start your account with that that's easy really okay so that's all actually it was very little so I didn't wanted to make a video on it but as some I had some topics so I just thought to make a video on it sorry for making it late but still thanks for your patience and well if you want to join my discord server I have a minecraft server in which with I f play with my friends if you want that you can join on my discord it will be linked in the description thank you for watching make sure you like the video if you enjoyed it and if you if this video helped you then you can leave me a comment then I will understand that my video helped you so it just feels good thanks for watching see ya